Is it big or small? It's big, bro. It's big. Okay. Let's see what you were thinking of. Open your hands. Oh. Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> you motherfucker. How you put you, a dick in my mouth. How did you know that? <laughs> I went to the flea market this morning. Yeah? Yeah, it was fun. I got a trinket. That's good. I bought a sign. I actually put it on the set because it matched. Right, oh, there, right there. Life life is a dry hand job. That's right. That's because that's how I feel. Welcome back to Impulsive, the number one podcast in nice. the world. Ladies and gentlemen, I feel good. I feel good. You guys know I'm recovering from tonsil surgery, uh, but this week I've been getting back into the swing of things. I can finally sort of talk now. Um, yesterday we went to a, we went to a, like a, what was that, a bar? Like a nice little restaurant? A nightclub. A oh, night- we went to a bar, Saddleback Saddle, Ranch. Saddleback Ranch. And they had this, um, you know those things where you can punch? Yeah. Oh, yeah. And- uh, He set the record. He I, set the record. I fucking set the record, dog. The record. So like, you, I, you, haven't even, you haven't even lost a moment? No, uh, bro. Like, I, I hit that shit. It, and I got, oh. I got 939. And I, like, I, I, I hate this. I hate that I'm saying this. But I do feel like my dick is a little bigger today. Yeah. That's good. The previous record was 9.33. There was a huge group of people around watching. So much pressure. And he just went up to that thing and he fucking walloped it. I walloped that shit, bro. So you're, like, you're ready to go at any moment. Facts. Like, Guys, listen. If you are not yet subscribed to Impulsive, make sure you subscribe wherever you listen to podcasts. iTunes, Spotify, YouTube, wherever. We also do an extended uh, audio Q&A with the guests after the visual is done. So hit that subscribe button. We have a very... Very special guest today. Today's guest is a man of magic. He's a viral sensation with over 16.6 million followers on Facebook. You've seen him perform magic for Drake. It's Julius Dean. Let's go. Thank you. Thanks for having me, Logan. Yo, thank you, bro. All the way from England, yeah? From England, London, England. Yo, listen to this accent. There we go. Hey, how's he, how are you guys doing? Say Damn. something really like English right now. Oh, the rain in Spain stays mainly on the plane. Oh, that was so that was English. Incredible. Yeah, you like that? It's incredible. It's fucking amazing, wow. dude. Thank you. How are you enjoying LA that's so probably far? The, that's better than most of the magic. I'm, I'm loving huh. LA. You like it? Yeah, it's good, good fun. What's your favorite part? Probably well, Santa Monica, Venice. Very, okay. Very chill. Hollywood's I'm, a bit heavy on the head, you know? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Of yeah. course I know, bro. I yeah. went there this morning and bought a sign that says, life is a dry hand job. <laughs> what, what? <laughs> we took it out of Hollywood. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, that's smart. Smart. Yeah. I, I, I'm in the valley. I'm, I'm away from Hollywood. I had to. It was a little too much for me. But, um, yo, it's good to see you here. I've, I've been a fan for a minute um, because you've been going viral for some time now. Like, a long ass time. And uh, when, when I saw this clip of you performing magic for Drake. I don't know if you guys have seen this. I'm gonna play this right here. This is this is incredible. Oh, you took it from my Twitter. <laughs> Why are you on Instagram, bro? Way better. Look, look. <laughs> so his favorite superhero is Batman. He's got a sucker in his mouth. He thought of a superhero. He said Batman. What's going on? What? It's Batman. So look. You carved Batman with your mouth. So let me get this straight, bro. Because I don't think I understand. You, he, 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 you asked him what his favorite superhero was. He said Batman and your, the lollipop was carved like Batman. <laughs> yeah. How you do that? Ah, uh, I can't tell you that again. Magician can't reveal his secrets. A magician can never, can never reveal his secrets. How you know he was going to say Batman? Because I'm a magician. Oh, it does make sense, I guess. That's why you're on the no, show. You say that. Yeah, no, that kind of. So, do you have a trick? Yeah, yeah. yeah you do have, You brought tricks today, I, huh? I did actually bring. Uh, I'm getting right into it. Because I want. I want. Do you have real powers? I do. I, I was born with special powers. Um, started when I was very young. Okay. Yeah, it's like uh, it's like mind reading powers. Okay. So, like at school, I would go up to girls, and as I was walking up to them, I knew they would walk away. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> you no, know, tell me you're a comedian, yeah, Julius. Yeah, I, I, I try, I try. I, I wish I would have known. <laughs> I know, I know. Do you guys want to see something? I, yeah. Yes, I okay. would love to. Um, we're going to try this with you, Mike. Okay. Got lollipop. Oh. oh, hold on, shit. hold on, hold on, hold on, bro. This is the Drake thing. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. I want you to think of a public figure and say it now. You want me to say, say it right now? Donald Trump. Come on. You could have said any public figure. Okay, so he's got a sucker in his we, hand. We're gonna we do with that. <laughs> nah, you doing the Drake thing? Just for impulsive. There's no way. There's no way. <laughs> okay, he's nah, working it. Nah, there's no way. This, there's no fucking there's way. There's no way. He's how chewing can, it. How can human even have that much saliva to mm. carve a lollipop this quickly? Mm. You better well, come out orange. He's like lapping it. 
Mm. I didn't make me doing this life. Life, um, life, life, mm. life really is a dry hand job. Mm. It really yeah. is. This is. Now I get it. Yeah, now, now it I makes sense. It. Mm. 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 Okay, he's working mm. it. He's working it. Yo, you could have searched any person in the world, right? Yeah. Mm, 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 you searched Donald Trump. It turned orange. It turned. It, it, what? <gasps> Yeah, what the fuck is? Oh my god, <laughs> is that? <laughs> Shut the <laughs> fuck <laughs> up, bro. Twist it this way a little bit. Oh my god, this is Donald Trump. It's even got the hair. Intricate, the hair flip. Wow, wow. I don't fucking get this, bro. How you do this? <laughs> wow. How you do this? Wow, look at that is incredible. Could you like do a magic wand to sh to end the shutdown by any chance, or is that like not possible? <laughs> Oh yeah, yo, this this that was incredible. Yeah, round of applause for right, Julius Dean. Guys. Yo, so that trick, that Amazing. trick, that trick impressed Drake. Now impressed the the cast of Impulsive. I don't know what to make that's, of that's this. That's the second time I've ever done that trick, by the way. Yeah. That really? Yeah. Let's fucking go. Like, cause you know it's amazing. It's good. It's amazing, bro. It, 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 it impressed Drake. Impressed you guys? It's yeah. Good. No, seriously. It's amazing. Yo, it's it's funny. Uh, it's funny you brought up Donald Trump. There's been. What do you think of Donald Trump? Wow, uh, uh, controversial character. Big facts. Tastes, uh, tastes nice. <laughs> <laughs> do you do you he smells, stay? He smells fruity too. Julius, uh, do you yeah. stay out of the out of the political shit? Yeah, you do. I, do, I, don't, but, I feel like as a magician, I don't have that much authority to. No, no, no. Don't ever say that. <laughs> Celebrities, magicians, athletes have just as much authority mm. as as regular people mm. to talk about why why because you no because here, here's here's what no because no because here's why because he has influence. Uh, I made I made a comment about this in my Hollywood Reporter article, and I and I, and I made a comment about um, influencers, celebrities, whatever, staying apolitical mm. as to not piss everyone off so they don't lose yeah, part of our fan base. Right. And that's I'm assuming what has happened with you and even like me to a point, but uh, plus he's from England, bro. Like what? Well, well, that's I true. think it, one of the most interesting things for me is to hear someone not from America and what their feelings are. That's why about, I you know, it's so interesting to hear. So, but if you're staying neutral for business reasons, that makes sense to me on the brand side. We know that, uh, that taking a political position is, is not a good play because mm. it polarizes Did, groups. Yeah. I, I think he'll, he'll, he'll probably get reelected again. Uh, I think he's very controversial, of course. But anyways, bro, back to Julius back to Dean. Back magic. Yeah. You have 16.6 .6 million followers on Facebook. And that's where I'm assuming <clears throat> the majority of your content has gone viral. How did you do that? That's a lot of fucking followers, bro. Hey, wow, well, yeah. It's you to you too. You also <laughs> do very well. <laughs> <laughs> I, got like, I got like 15 million something, but yeah, Mike yells at me, bro, because I don't use it ever. He I doesn't use his Facebook. Yeah, I, I saw the, I, I've saw your, saw your transition from yeah. Vine to Facebook to Instagram to yeah, YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I've seen that. And I've also done the same thing, utilizing Instagram a lot. Um, Facebook, just the share button, dude. You know, I go to new places. You know, last month I was in Jamaica, Hawaii. That, that video in Jamaica... Uh, Jamaica reacts to magic. This one got 8 million views, but I thought there was one with like 20 something. This is, fun. This is all stuff. 26 million views. Jamaica reacts to magic. Imagine it smashing. So we actually went out to Jamaica for this. <laughs> Just to do magic? Yeah. yeah. And are these reactions genuine, bro? Look at her, she's crying. <laughs> these are genuine reactions? Look, look, it's a bunch of school kids. How else? Are, you made the awesome. Jamaicans cry? I, that's, that's, I bring my, I, <laughs> Where's your ma MAGA hat? <laughs> I gave her a hug at the end, look. I, 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 oh, all right. Give me three seconds, go on. There we go, so I gave her a hug. I think that might be one of my favorite things about his stuff is the react. He, he gets these priceless reactions from people. I was gonna ask, how are they genuine? Bro. Of course, yes, 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 yes. Drake. How am I going to get Drake? Did of course, Drake. But like, are they like they, what they, percentage they, is fabricated? The, the, the reactions are absolutely genuine. Yeah, yeah. If you That's watch amazing. that, if you watch that video. You could watch the entire three minutes of that video. There are 15, 20 clips. Every single one involves you know multiple people in Jamaica. You know, it's a setting. You know, what I do is I bring crazy magic to people all over the world. So, so. If, if someone reacts to a trick that is, uh, and they're not enthusiastic about mm. it, will you not? <laughs> well, some, sometimes I, I fail. And you fail. I do. I what happens? Fail. And I, I put in some sad music and I look at the camera. No, but you keep it real. 
You, you still put it in the cut, I, yeah? I still put it in the cut. So, very often. Not every single fail because it is a numbers game. What you see at the end, I'm sure as you familiar with, you see the final product. Yeah. But yeah, to, I do put in fail sometimes. It what's, makes it more real, makes it more relatable. What's one of the worst fails you've had? Oh, um, well, this wasn't actually not in for a video, but I did a performance at Web Summit, Lisbon. Uh, it was 25,000 people in the audience. Yeah. Massive stadium. I was going on just before one of the founders of Facebook, not Mark Zuckerberg, the other guy, yep. Dustin. Um, and Some pressure there. I did the trick, the big finale, where I basically shake a piece of paper and the card rises up on the piece of paper. And as I do it, uh, the, the, the massive screens, they cut to the audience because the audience is staring. So as the trick happens, everyone is seeing the massive screens because it goes so far back. No one can see me. Oh. So there's just silence. I was expecting, oh, well, you know, I was expecting oh, a, a cheer, a, you know, that, yeah. <gasps> that, that sucks. I, it was awkward. Yeah, so I literally borderline ran off stage. I thought it was quite funny to be fair, but I was, Freaked out a little bit. Well, yeah, that's it, that's not, that wasn't your fault. That was like a technical difficulty. You know what? It shows the, the importance of rehearsals. Yeah. Truth. I got a little bit cocky. I was like, I don't need to do rehearsals. I know this trick inside out, but sometimes it's not about me. It's about the camera team. Yeah. So I've learned from yeah. my mistakes. <laughs> what's, so what's the biggest uh, crowd you've, you've performed in front of? Well, that was the biggest crowd. 25,000? Yeah, that was the biggest. And you, yeah. and, and you fucked it up. <laughs> <laughs> I did. <laughs> That's not as bad though as Ninja for the New Year's. Like just, oh, sh <laughs> just the flop, bro. Oh, oh that was just, that was, is I don't it, know about all that, bro. Is that <laughs> too soon? No, it's not too soon. It's just like, did you see that? No, I didn't see that. Not. Nah, it could be worse is what I'm getting at. It could be. <laughs> but we didn't see this, bro. We Thanks, man. I, I really I appreciate it, bro. <laughs> all these years of practice, sleight of hand. And plus, nah, like, fucked it up. You gotta, you gotta empathize with Ninja. He he, um, he he did this dance. He did the floss dance and he tried to get like people in the crowd to do it for like the New Year's thing. And uh like no one did it, and, it, and it, but he was trying so hard. He was trying. And it was like, raining. And exactly. Like it's not his fault because I've been there. Where like you're, you're trying to be enthusiastic, yeah. and by the way, he's probably getting paid, so it's like he he wants to like do a good job. Hype him up, and no one's fucking doing it because they're like, yeah, I'm not seven years old. I don't feel like flossing. Right. Uh, <laughs> why you bring him up? I'm sorry. It's just <laughs> it just I mean it resonated with that uh, you know in flopping, front of a big crowd. I, I was trying to help make make it feel better. All right. <laughs> so, so so yo, why I one of the reasons I really respect you not only because the magic is good and you have this uh, very uh, you have an amazing uh, presence and charisma, but um, your ability to analyze social and almost growth hack in a way is incredible. And yeah. your work ethic is great. And um, yes. you didn't say this. But that's why you have 16.6 .6 million followers. Um, I read, that. I read a, a quote somewhere. You said it. The street magician and performer said he owes his online success to his knowledge of SEO analytics <laughs> and his boy. devotion to magic tricks. Yeah. No, well, I started <laughs> posting videos on the internet because I was when I was 19, I'm 24 now. When I was 19, I was trying to get gigs in London, like, you know, a couple hundred quid, pounds, yeah. you know, <laughs> yep. about $500 here and there <laughs> right. to perform. So I got to do the translation for you guys. Um, so I realized that if I got what's called backlinks on the internet, basically, if I get other websites to link to my website, I will show up higher on Google. On Google. Yeah, yeah. So if people look for a magician, um, I will show up higher on Google. So that means I'm, I, I will be more likely to be booked than my competitors because I have more leads. And then after doing a few months of that, it just took a big turn. And I realized actually the video game is in itself what I want to go into rather than just using that to perform at events. Interesting that. Got yeah. you. Yeah. yeah. But I mean, yeah. But I think um, as I'm sure you would agree, the most important thing to, to you know, build an audience and um, get lots of followers is great content. Great content. Great content yeah. and, and, and work ethic, bro. How often are you churning out videos? Uh, we're posting, well, the, the, last, uh, the last week I haven't, but you know, very often every day. Every fucking day. Yeah, yeah, what we'll do is we'll, we'll go to Jamaica. Me, I'll have a, have a team. Why always Jamaica? <laughs> <laughs> not, every, not every time Jamaica. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll choose a different place. Okay. You know, so Miami, Jamaica, India, you know, London, all, all over the world. Um, Just and, to do magic. And yeah, exactly. It's like bringing magic to these quirky places. Um, I'll have a video, videographer. Um, sometimes I work with the tourist boards that will like hook me up. So for, for Jamaica, we had security, we had tour buses. Oh, tight, tight. Yeah, it was good. I, I bet that was a fun trip. It, it was, very, it was the, an amazing trip. Bro, when yeah. you get hooked up like that, it, yeah, oh, sure. tour bus is yeah, great. I'm sure. I've yeah. seen, but if, I've you, seen, if you need an introduction for Jamaica, I've got you. Maybe I've never been. That'd be fun. You'd fit in. I've seen you do a lot of stuff at music festivals mm. too, and like that—that's another thing I've noticed about you. Like you—you—you you, you made magic social and like culturally relevant. Like you went to Drake. You went to ultra probably yeah, yeah, right yeah, yeah, and then yeah. you and then you were and you do a lot of stuff with influencers right? right and so like you were so smart in how you 
positioned your approach through influencer and like kind of culturally relevant content. But I remember the one, the one piece of content that always sticks out to me is that time you went to ultra for that kid that was on Molly or whatever. Yeah, wait, yeah. Oh wait, 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 what this happened? Is, what this happened? Is, you got to find it's, it's it. On, it's, it's, it, it's on it, Instagram. This it, kid is literally yeah, tweaked out of his, out of his damn mind. Tell me when to stop scrolling. Uh, scroll down, That's scroll pretty down, far down. Scroll down, down, scroll down, scroll down. Wait, wait, what, so Mike, what is this, you did magic for a kid on Molly? And oh, did he just know what? Uh, we don't know down. what he was on, but just watch it. You'll see, dude. Am I close? Yeah, keep going. This is all Jamaica stuff. <laughs> Holy damn, shit. you go to Jamaica often? He's there pretty uh, much yeah. every day. <laughs> What's up with keep you going. in Jamaica, quite, dog? I know, it's quite far. I keep going. Um, Should I well, speed up my no, scrolling no, 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 speed? There he is. Go up, go up, go up, go up. Right in the there middle there, buddy. There he is. Oh my God. No, he's sober, man. This is the best thumbnail I've seen in my life. It's a good thumbnail. It's incredible. Watch this. And Andre, Andre, you gotta watch, watch the whole thing. I'm so excited for what's about that. Looks like Johnny Sins. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> His profile picture. Okay, yeah. what is this? Coke, Coca Cola, yeah. 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 Struggle with that one. Whoa. Bam. Wow, did you know that? It is the Coca Cola cap, but a bigger bottle, bro. That is it. <laughs> Magic tricks are very entertaining. I think. I think you should pursue this. I do this game. Yeah. Follow him. Follow the man, the magician. Okay, yeah. Where's the problem? Yo, so shut the fuck up. Account. When you perform for people on drugs, it's gotta be that much better. The reactions are incredible. Yeah, we, we got a lot. So, so that, yeah, that was a, a video called Hi People React to Magic, Festival Magic. And that was at Ultra, yeah? It was at Ultra. We had a field day. We went around for two days just filming so much magic. And it's gotta be like shooting fish in a barrel with people on drugs there. I mean, it, that festival is, <laughs> is just everybody. Fuck, it, was, bro. it was a field day. Um, it, sometimes people are so off their heads, it's hard to control them. Yeah. You know, because they, they can't concentrate. They didn't know what's yeah. going on. Yeah. There was that one, and there was one with a lady. To, do you know oh, which dude. one with the lady? I know exactly what it was. Go, go down should, and go should, one more time. Is it? it it's equally. Fuck, it's equally. Just scroll down. This, one. this it, one's equally. While I do this, can you explain when you say we, what you mean? Because you have a team here. I don't yeah. know. Like, you got, you got like four dudes here. <laughs> What's the role of your team? Like, you all go together? Sure. So, so yeah. So, I have a, I have a videographer who travels with me full time called Lee. Um, I often have a magic advisor who will be behind the scenes, who will be doing things like passing me tricks whilst I'm performing. So, when the energy is high on the crowd, I don't have to be stop and look around for stuff. You feel me? Okay. Um, and then I have, you know, manager, agent, that type of thing. But it's, it's pretty small, like four or five people total in the team. And usually, when I travel, I'll travel with maybe two or three additional people. There's Yo, you, you did Post Malone? Yeah. Oh yeah, this one was great. Keep it hidden. Keep it hidden. Okay, here we go. Straight face, all right? Okay, just think of your card. Ace, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Just smart of nine. Oh no, oh no, look at me, look at me, look at me. Diamonds. Nine of diamonds. How the hell can you do that? You should use your skill for poker. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you should see, like, scroll, scroll up a little bit. Up, 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 on the right. This girl? That's the lady. Yeah, this is ultra. This, okay. this is the one. <laughs> Got oh some my co God. colored pencils, <laughs> and they're oh. empty, and now it's full. <laughs> <laughs> she, she doesn't give a fuck about your she magic. She doesn't. <laughs> she doesn't. But it was great. <laughs> That's incredible. Two point nine million views. Yeah, no, that was that was it was good. Sometimes you know it's, uh, that's a good example of sometimes the magic doesn't go how you want it to go. But then you look at it after and you're like, wow, that was great. hilarious. Yeah. I saw you on, uh, you did great, or uh, Good Morning Britain. Is oh my gosh. You hear about that? You, yeah, you, I saw, I saw it. All right. Tell me, tell me about this. <laughs> tell me about this. All right. So, so Good Morning Britain is a, a huge breakfast show in Britain, as mm -hmm. you would guess. Um, and I decided to, uh, I did a few tricks um, and I thought it went great. Because I mean, the, the, the audience, everyone yeah, was reacting yeah. great, the, you know, the presenters. So I got off the show and my Twitter started buzzing off. And I don't really use Twitter. I mainly use Instagram and Facebook, um, which is why it's funny. You, you took the Drake Twitter while I was like, why do you Twitter? Why do you Twitter? <laughs> anyway, um, I, I look at my Twitter and it's like all these different UK press outlets, Huffington Post, Daily Mail, just big press outlets grilling me saying, Julius Dean is the worst magician oh, in the world. Oh. We could see how he did the trick. And then there was this trick where like, you might have been, you couldn't even it see it. You lifted right? your glasses, like, right? Yeah, exactly. I'm not doing that trick on this one. I, I learned, <laughs> I learned, I learned my lesson. <laughs> Wait, why? They, because you could see the string? No, 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 absolutely not. What happened? <laughs> what happened? Yeah. My response was to the, the Daily Mail actually emailed me and they said, why? Did you have a string? Have you got any comments on it? And I said, I had to have the string in case my superpowers did not work. Oh, uh, safety. Like backup. Uh, right. safety. Very important to be prepared. But why would they assume otherwise? Like I would know that. Yeah. 
I know that. Exactly. Why Why are they asking, why did you have a string? Why do you think, you morons? <laughs> the fuck? And, but you know, the funniest thing As is- if you, it's you, a mystery. You could you could not even see the string. I looked at, I didn't see it. I know, because you can't see it, bro. Because there's people that love to, love, people love to hate on people. And people love to hate on magicians. Yeah. Because especially, because, because, especially magicians. Especially, especially magicians. And successful magicians. Yeah. Like, have you ever seen someone hate on a broke down, like not good magician? True. True. Just like, oh, this poor fuck. I, I like think, you, think, you, like you're out here just getting dough. Get, be speaking and also getting girls. So I've partied with Julius before in New York. <laughs> I was gonna ask <laughs> this, like, bro. This dude, you get all, all these girls you're gonna use as fuck. This is a fail, by the way. This is when I fail. This is a good example of when chicks go wrong. Wait, but why, how, how are all these girls so hot? You you pick out the hot girls to do no, tricks because you know they give you hot girls like magic. That's a fact. So so yeah. So I want I want to touch on that. So we were out at, at Tao in 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 New York City. I was there. And he <laughs> and magic magically he's at the dinner. I show up and and so weird. I said Julius Dean, what the fuck is going on? It's amazing. Was there like a poof of smoke? <laughs> it was yeah, basically. And his and his assistant at the time. I don't know where the hell he is today. Yeah. But uh, we're at this long table and it, there's all these you know models in New York City socialites and shit and. By the you know by the end of the night they're all drinking taking shots so on and so forth <laughs> and this dude it's just he, girls love magic especially when they're just like having a good time so like saying, a, it's not just hot girls like, like are you the girls first love magic. are you the first magician to like magically like pull rabbits out of vaginas like you dude like that has that happened before bro like was there a magician before you <laughs> that got as much I, I'm probably not the first magician to ever do magic to good looking girls yeah but. I also do magic to, to all different types of people from, you know, not good looking girls. I feel like you're going to say- Guys yeah. and old people and young people yeah. <laughs> and even animals. Does, oh, does, it's coming up, video does, coming up. Does magic, <laughs> does magic get you laid? Uh, uh, well- he, Your boy's nodding his head. People, are, people, <laughs> people say, where would I be without magic? And the answer is probably a virgin. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking. No, no, no I mean, it's not true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good, no, no, no. For, for, for real, people do ask me this seriously, and the answer is it's it's a great conversation starter. It breaks the ice. It's it's great to take someone out of their boring reality instead of having a small talk conversation when you're at a bougie area like Tao, where everyone's talking about you know what houses they bought, and what cars they drive, and, like that, you know, yeah. trying to impress you know. But but does. you don't. But it, it seems like a part of your puzzle. Like mm. you're not a bad looking dude. You got that, a good. You, got, part, you know what I'm saying? Like you got a I good do. demeanor. Like you're you're fun. You're fun. You're upbeat. Girls love. A, a guy that smiles, makes jokes, makes him laugh. So like, but like you throw a, the ability to make her credit card bill disappear. That's fucking, that's yeah. dope. Major. Yeah, that's hey, promising. Yeah. That's Super major, sick. Like magic. Yeah. Can I see another trick? Yeah, bro, let's do it. Let's um do this. You, uh, you asked me to think of a card before. Yeah. Right? Let's, let's try, you know, I'm going to stand up for this. Okay. Ooh, Should okay. I stand up? Yeah, bro, stand up. Do you want me to hold a mic yeah, or some I shit? I can, I can take this. Um, This is what I wanted to do. <clears throat> I would like you to, right, okay, so you, you've been having, uh, you, you, you fought KSI, right? That's a fact. That's a fact, it was a draw. Uh, Unfortunately, also a fact. I mean, it depends who you're asking, really, up, man. We could for dive into rounds, so I thought I was 4-2. Oh, yeah, yeah, I thought it was 4-2. <laughs> the judge, the judge called it a draw. I think he was drunk, man, I'll be honest with yeah. you. So, there's a rematch, we're looking forward to the rematch. And I thought that we could try something that fused my magic and your fighting skills. Ooh. Yeah? Are you sure you want to do this? I, I will reiterate. I got the high score yesterday Saddle at, Ranch. at Saddle Ranch. I got nine nine thirty nine, and I and I beat the record on the punching bag. Are do you, you want this? Smoke? Do you want this smoke? For impulsive, we're gonna do it. He wants the smoke. He wants the smoke. That's what we're gonna do. Um, think of a card, and I want you, you, you. You've got a glove. Yeah, he had me bring my boxing glove. I asked him to bring his boxing gloves with him. Again, I, oh wow, that's, that's authentic. I'm not sure fight. he does want this. It's the smoke. <laughs> oh no. Those gloves just kind of magically appeared down there. Wow, you're, you're getting, you're big by the way, Logan. I don't know if anyone's ever told you that. So Logan's putting the glove yeah. on, not Julius. He said it before, dude. He's not big everywhere. Mm. Just, <laughs> just, just what you could see. Hey, is he going to magically take a <laughs> small punch? <laughs> oh, all right, this is what we're going to do. Okay. Is this what? In your mind, I, hold, hold, hold out your fist like this, right? In your mind, I want you to think of a card. I want you to take your fist like this and I want you to, as hard as you can, smack me, okay? Do you mean that? Smack you or Smack punch you? Punch me. Punch me. Oh my God. I'm gonna ask you one more time, hey. friend. 939. Do you want this smoke, bro? I set the high score. Yes. Hey, did he sign did. the waiver? Did he say he did sign the waiver? I signed it. The man outside maybe signed the waiver. Okay, okay we're good. Fair enough. Turn, right. your shoulder. Turn like this. Right, here we go. You're gonna go right here. You're gonna go right here. Come, come a little closer. Okay, here we go. 
Hey man, make, well, yo, all right, make believe that MAGA kid's face is on his arm right now. Here we go. <laughs> and you and you want to keep that card in your mind, yeah? This is important. Okay. Yeah, and you want to smack me. But when I say smack British for punch, yeah? Wait, all right, move your arm down a little yeah. bit like that. <laughs> all right. Give him 60%. No, 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 no. You go, you go all out here. Should, okay. All right, this yeah, is, come, this come is close, you literally close. have a golden ticket right now to punch. Should we let the audience know what card it is or no? This is Logan's No, you, card. you think about okay, it. Okay, he's got it? All right. Oh, oh, God damn! Like, I almost broke my wrist. Doing magic <laughs> oh, I'm so I'm so sad for you, Logan. You almost broke your wrist. Oh, what? <sighs> what was the card? What is this magic? What's the magic part? The card was a yeah. uh, four of clubs. <sighs> what is going on? He's lifting his sleeve. You gotta be. <laughs> what? <laughs> I hate you, Julius, dude. You son of a bitch. There's a four of clubs on his How'd shoulder. You get that? I'm just. Scarlet. Tattooed on. How did you do that? What the fuck is this? You just caused a bruise, bro. What the f- Oh my- God. Julius Dean, ladies and gentlemen. What? I mean- I don't know how you did that. What kind of pagan on? bullshit? <laughs> What'd you say about vegans? Ooh. <laughs> that was the quickest forming bruise I've ever seen in my life. Ah, bro. <laughs> you are good Oh. That's Like, fucking- literally, when I, when I hit him, bro, because I, I didn't put my wraps on my, like, fucking wrist rolled. You got a thick arm. Bro, you got a big punch. You, do you lift weights? A little bit, a little bit. Do you eat meat? <clears throat> uh, <laughs> we talk about my fitness and my, my well, time. Just, I didn't I, think I'd be coming on a post of talking about my we're, fitness. We're, 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 we're talking about a, whatever, bro. I'd give you guys a couple of tips. Yeah, a bit, a bit of paleo, a lot of meat, vegetables. What, you ever, would you ever go vegan? Uh, no, I would not go vegan. <sighs> Because I, I just we're vegan right now. Vegan. I, I so, so we're vegan. Still happening. We're still I saw, good. I saw that. I, I, I'm still doing it. You think, you think you think that's gonna last? Huh? You think that's gonna last? Um, for the month of January. Yeah, yeah. We're we're cl- a finish line. Strong. We are on the finish line. Yeah. Yo, that was impressive, dog. Nice man. How did the bruise form that fast? You got a good punch. Okay. How did you know I was gonna pick that card? Because I I'm thought like, of it. I didn't say it out loud to anyone. I'm, I'm a magician. No, oh yeah, no, 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 yeah. Fuck that. Tell us how. <laughs> how did you do that shit, bro? You want to know? Yeah. Yeah, we really want to know. People got to ask you often, like, yo, how you, sh- sh- like, come on, you know, yeah, it's, yeah, me, it's people, me, it's Logan, bro, you're yeah. fine. Like, yeah, I mean, yeah, bro, yeah, 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 come on. These guys aren't watching. No, 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 no. This is off, off record. We we this part, we'll cut, cut this, this part out. out. Well, why are you talking to the camera then? Because, <laughs> hey, Hayden, when you see this, you cut this part out, please. Thank you. <laughs> Hayden doesn't even edit this show, bro. He's a fax. <laughs> <laughs> How do, how do you deal with assholes? You gotta have some people who are like, yo, this fucking, I saw the string. Saw bro. the string, I man. saw that before you, before I punched you. Like, how you deal with that? Uh, well, it, it, honestly, it, it's just, you know, just laughing at it. You know, it's just, it's the whole thing is very funny to me. Like people who are, the haters, you know, the ones that are like, I know how you do that. You get that a lot. You, you, cause when you go to a party and you right. perform, you gotta have the one, the dude, like the alpha, who's like, nah, man, like, I'm, I know all his tricks. Like the, girl, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, the girls will be like, how did he do that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you, get, you do get, you get, you get the envious, the jet. I want yeah. the, you know, the attention seekers. Yeah, yeah. Some people might lie, that. right? About I, the cards that they choose and all that kind of stuff. Uh, often, you know, with you guys, I kind of trust it. I'll trust that you're not going to change your mind to the last second. I won't. You know? Yeah, what, but what? I mean, you can, you can get a good vibe pretty fast. Yeah, yeah. respect. You yeah. Have, you have magicians that you look up to. Oh, oh wow! Magicians I look up to, uh, I, probably like the modern day, like you know David Blaine. I think what he did was very cool. I, 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 what I find more interesting than the magic tricks themselves is just the journey of how they got there, you of know, how like, they got like, where, well, of how they how they built, you know, their like, empire. How they how they okay yeah yeah. So it, it, honestly, even someone like Vitaly, like an OG of YouTube, yeah, it's very interesting how he started in the game, was consistently posting. Um, was you know, really grinding at the, the pranks, and that's kind of how he how he built a huge audience. So you, are you fr- you're tight with him? Yeah, you hang out with the. Uh, I mean, I, I like him. We don't we don't hang out. You're with Jay more with Alvarez. Yeah, yeah, yeah we hang out as well. Yeah, yeah didn't saw- you didn't you do something with my brother? Didn't you join Team Ten? Yeah, I was. Yeah, you guys saw me. I was actually invisible for that for that three months, but uh, part, part of the show. That's fucking incredible. <laughs> yeah, no, I did something with him a few months ago. So, a few months ago, but like when we did it last year. Yeah. What do you think of Jake when you met him? Um, I mean, bro, he's 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 doing very well. You know, he's he's killing it. You guys are both. You could you could be honest, man. Yeah, you could be honest. You could be honest. I'm taking. No, I, it was cool. cool. I, I, yeah, it was good, yeah. man. He, he, you know, he he played to the camera. Of course, bro. You know? Played to the camera. Jake's but, so different off camera. Yeah, I mean, he's he's dope as fuck. I like him better off camera. Mm. Like, I, you, would you say you're the same on camera, off camera? Uh, on this show, yeah, but um, on, on the vlogs, I try to like, I try to only show the most hype, yeah. fascinating, fun parts of my life. Mm. 
because that's like entertainment for sure. Yeah, yeah. I thought uh, he was he was very easy to work with, you know. Yeah, you know? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. he's, he's a cool fucking dude yeah. from Ohio. We're real exactly. Real I mean, I, I've performed with a lot of different you know, of public figures. Post Malone's great. Drake, yeah, amazing. Um, Diplo, very chill, hard. Yeah, you know? yeah. We've hung, yeah. we've hung with Diplo. Yeah. How, yeah. How, how did you get to Drake, by the way? How did I get to Where Dr- was yeah. that? We're at some sort of club. Oh, like- so he, he actually has been following me. We, we follow each other on Instagram. Oh, t- oh shit, dope. <laughs> and he messaged oh, me. Right. He messaged me and he was just like, bro, what are you doing uh, today? And I was like, well, let me check my schedule. <laughs> I'm free. <laughs> <laughs> I'm free. <laughs> and tomorrow, and the day after. No, um, yeah, so I went to his party. He had his, his Scorpion launch party for his for his, al- his album, album launch. Yeah. Um, and he just said, come along. And I, was, I said, cool, I'll be no there. No way. 9 p.m. So I messaged him. I actually get that like an hour and a half early. I didn't want to bring in any big cameras because I knew obviously intimidating. He might find it weird. Yeah. His team might be like, what yeah. the hell is going on? Yeah. So we only brought a phone with us. We got there early. We checked out all the different areas to film of the club. It's a very small club in London called Annabelle's. Okay. Um, so we get there. We, we, we're checking, testing it out, the different places. Is, and all of a sudden, Drake pops his head through through the audience. And I'm like, and he goes, hey, Julius. What's that like for you? What's that feel like? Um, I went into automatic, like, right, because I my videographer, Neil, my videographer, Neil, um, we knew that we didn't have very long to do this because um, he was running, it's his party. You know, yeah. if, you have, if you have a party, you're going to say hello to everyone, right? Yeah, you're not yeah. going to be just spending an hour watching magic. Maybe you are, but anyway, we knew we had a limited time frame. So we'd prepared at the moment the uh, interaction happened, we were just hitting with magic. So I wanted to get that clip because I felt like it would be, you know, it, it would be a great clip. Of course. So the moment it happened, I went into a- automatic. I said, I said, Drake, you want to see magic? Mind if we film it? Yeah, well, for sure. Cool. He was very, very chill. You know, literally, it looked like he was just stepped out of his, you know, just out of his room. He was just, you know, relaxing in his you, own you, house. You think he invited you hoping you he would, you would film a magic trick? That's a good question. I think he wanted to see a magic trick. I don't think he cared if I filmed it. I don't think he needs the clout. I, got it. I, I feel yeah. like, I well, feel, what do you think? I don't know, bro. I mean, I know celebrities and uh, there's there was even a YouTuber who called out celebrities for doing I think it was I think it was Lily Singh who called out celebrities for using internet stars to promote their thing. Like on your post with Drake, did you do hashtag Scorpion or anything? Like I did, I think I did hashtag Drake. But, I, nice, but he, yeah. but, but he doesn't he doesn't need the clout. I'm just saying, like some celebrities are like super forward thinking like that. Mm. What's uh, wrong with that well, though? You, no, no, I don't uh, think it's there's nothing wrong with it if there's uh if both parties know what's happening and there's a symbiotic understanding well, was, yeah. of like I'm with you I'll use you, you as an example I'm with you Drake and it's it's helping me and my brand because it's super cool and this video is going to get seen by lots and also like Drake I'm helping you because my audience who may or may not know you they fucking mm. know Drake um they will now see this video and maybe buy your album. Yeah, yeah, I, I feel that. I, I, my gut instinct and from my, from, my underst- from my conversations, he did not seem like he cared at all, he prob- 1% oh, he about does, a tag. Probably does you not know? give a fuck. Even my, if it got, yeah. he probably, he probably t- he, I think that Drake has obviously, obviously done incredibly well, has everything in life, you know, all the women, all yeah. the money, all the luxuries, and he likes magic. And he, and there's not, there are not many people doing what I'm doing, which is magic on the internet. Yeah. So he saw me, He's like, okay, this guy does magic, watching my stuff. He likes my stuff every now and then. Likes likes it, and he thought, all right, let's let's get this that's guy. Tight. In. That's yeah. tight. Dude. Feel, he actually feel... did, he did the same with another guy who vaped, and he brought the vape guy in to show him some. Oh, vape some tricks. vape tricks. Do, 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 do you hear about that? I, I mean, I, I've seen the vape tricks. No, he flew the guy. He flew the guy over to his, to, to to Canada yeah, just to. Uh, oh shit! Yeah, just so uh, some it's vape. a good. Yeah, exactly. That's tight. I, I've, I've noticed Mike's been trying to say something for a solid no, right. ninety seconds. You guys on a fucking yeah, roll. He, he was kind of like, hey, hey, babe. Uh, 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 I just feel, like, I feel like I feel like he probably would have invited you to do magic tricks for his guests too. Do you know what I'm saying? Like he you know seems what? like the kind no, of guy I'm, like that. Like I'll tell you something just, interesting. He. So I said we got there early for the lighting. Yeah. I wanted to make sure we got good lighting. The moment I did that lollipop trick. He said, Julius, come with me. He literally took my hat. It felt like something I was like- And kicked you out of the party. And kicked me out of the party. He was like- (laughs) Get the fucking fucking satanic (laughs) ritual motherfucker. He he took me over to to his table um, where the DJ booth was. Lighting was horrific. Um, Music was so loud. Um, There was a bunch of people there. French Montana was there. Stormzy was there. Skepta was there. I did more magic. I got more footage. It's so inaudible that I didn't use any of it. His was almost inaudible. His was good. It, it was, was almost, bro. Mm. Like even even post Malone, like that shit's loud. Yeah, and I'm sure you're like, fuck, dude. Like I have to take these people to somewhere where it's like kind of quiet, the yeah. lighting's good, all that, which has got to be a hassle. You did it though, so congrats. Thanks, man. Appreciate um, it. Um, yo, so you, you mentioned David Blaine, right? 
Uh, I, I, I love David Blaine. I want him to come on this podcast one day, but is there, is there, a, he, he goes beyond um, just magician to me, his feats of endurance mm. and the, the level that he takes things are so unprecedented and incredible. Are you striving to ever do that type of thing? I'm talking like where he holds his breath for 17 minutes. Yeah. Sits in a block of ice for nine years straight. Um, he's just done the craziest shit. Um, catches a bullet in, or in his mouth. I don't know. Again, I don't know if it's real, but um, I saw his documentary. It's, and it's incredible. Do you have any goals like that? So I think we come from different ends of the spectrum. Like I'm using magic to amaze, um, to, to entertain, um, you know, particularly to amaze. I think uh, David Blaine, you know, would borderline put himself at danger. At oh, he very has. Very serious yeah, danger. He has, sure. bro. Yeah. He stabs his arm with like, uh, with exactly. like metal rods and exactly, shit. Exactly, exactly. And, and I'm not trying to kill myself because I'm enjoying life and I don't feel like <laughs> I need to prove myself, you know? It's way. not your brand. Yeah, it's not my it's brand. Not exactly, brand. it's not my brand. I'm, I'm, the, I'm the kind of happy go, yeah. go to cool places, you know, interact with, with people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But know. what if you're like happy and you hold your breath for 13 minutes? Well, like, I, like, yo, I, I never saw him smile. Have you seen, oh shit. Uh, it's, it is true. I don't know if David Blaine smiles. <laughs> I've, I don't think I've ever seen David Blaine smile. I'm sure he's <laughs> laughed a couple of times in his life. He, you see the thing where he, um, he fucking, have you seen this where he like, um, uh, upchucks frogs? Yeah. Yeah, I've yep. seen that. Very cool. Julius, you're a magician. How does David Blaine throw up frogs? <laughs> Steve O did it though. Yeah, I, th I think, honestly, I think some of that yeah. comes down to a little bit of regurgitation skills. Like actual. Yeah, it kind of fuses you. Uh, yeah. Like real. That's not. Yeah. yeah, some of this, bro. I love oh. David Blaine too. He's mysterious, but some of it's like kind of spooky. Yeah. Yo, he's it's, throwing it's, up frogs into glasses and spooky. like multiple frogs. What are you doing? I'm pissing. Uh, I, again, so this is I, an issue. I just don't get it. We, we I just get a, don't get it. We know we're filming a podcast at 4 p.m. And for some reason, he doesn't go to the bathroom before the show. On the set, could we have like trap doors under the seat? So if you someone's about to get up, just we should, bro. Just gone. It's, fucking, it's like you made the mistake. You shouldn't have done that. I agree. I never come back. Yeah. <laughs> we'll forgive this my, is getting on I'm hand. just like, you, you really think he's... Throwing up frogs. Yeah, I mean, he clearly is throwing up frogs. No question. Fuck. I mean, that's def definitely no question. <laughs> he is throwing up frogs. And you never want to do no, that. Nothing in his mouth. Ah, frogs in his mouth. Ah. What about when he's like catching bullets and shit? Well, that's is that's how. Now, now you're trying to get into the realm of how he does do the magic. Do you know how? Well, I wouldn't be very happy if David Blaine was here telling you how. I did oh, magic. so there's like a there's a magician code. There's a magician code. Yeah. What, like is, a, what is it? <laughs> you shouldn't tell me why you do tricks. So. Are there any magicians out there that have kind of like exposed other people and you just kind of like the magician yeah. crowd is just like, you know, I mean, that guy? I look, if if no one ever told anyone how they do their tricks, then no one would be a magician. True. Right? It would just die out after, you know, the first, first magician. Um, so you can learn magic, but I think generally there's a code that you shouldn't reveal tricks of the trade, you know? But, you know, I, I teach people a trick here and there. Yeah, yeah you got to you gotta give it, you got to pass it on. Yeah, exactly. And, some, honestly, and I've actually been called it in trouble with the magician community because um, sometimes when I fail on my tricks. You leave it, you leave the fail in. I leave the fail in, you see how the trick is done and there's been some, some controversy uh, in the magic community. We're like, oh, Julius is doing tricks. Do you give a shit? Uh, I, I do give it a little bit of a shit, but I've decided that I'm, the, in the name of great content, um, I will do it, but I'll be careful. You know, I won't reveal, yeah. if a massive fail happens, it reveals a huge public stunt. Mm. You know, that's not good for me. And it's not good for other magicians. But if it's something small, then that's okay. Does your accent help? Help with what? <laughs> Just you being a magician. Success, I feel like it does. Your success. Good question. I feel like it does. Uh, like honestly, I've never, I've never not had an accent, so I wouldn't actually be able to compare. But do you think you're like extra smooth because of it? Because that's how I feel. Like okay. I wish I had an accent. Someone said, I was with, uh, <laughs> I was with a girl today at the the, uh, the flea market. And uh, was a, 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 just a... a <laughs> Uh, this British guy came up to her and said, uh, he said, he said, they were having a conversation. He said, you're not an easy girl to forget, darling. Whoa. But in a British accent, it works. You're not an easy, you're not an easy girl to, person to forget, darling. Did you tell him to back yeah, off? Hold on. Say, no, no, no. He was an older guy, man. He was doing his thing. Was, okay. All right. it, but, uh, All right. I, I tried to say in an American accent, it's like, uh, you're not an easy girl to forget, darling. Uh, and it's, it's just, just whack. Yeah. <laughs> right. Can you, Julius? Can you say it really quick? Yeah, sure. <laughs> it's tough to look at you and Zach. Can you look at that girl and say it too yeah, at the sure. same time? 
You're not an easy girl to forget, darling. Oh, oh my God. It's just, is that good? Right. She just it's melted. She melted. <laughs> She's not even here anymore. It works. That's what I'm saying. There's something yeah. with the accent. I'm just a fucking dumb kid from Ohio with this. And I can't say, ta- I say talented weird. <laughs> talented. And challenge. Challenged. And I think there are other... Are there other areas in the world where if we go, people are like, oh, that's amazing. Or, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Definitely. In, in London, people be like, oh, my God. Oh, oh my God. You have an American accent. <laughs> <laughs> You're the basic white girl. Yeah. <laughs> that was, Would you ever collab with David Blaine? Uh, good question. Um, honestly, probably not. Why? Different different, um, different generations. He, he's, he'd, he's ask, like, he'd ask you to like set yourself on fire for as long as possible. Like and pull a sword <laughs> out of your butt. Know, so, <laughs> he, he's probably trying to sabotage me if he does that. He's, he's protective, you know, because some magicians, the whole point of them being a magician is that they're special. You know, that's, that's what they're saying. I am a magician. I have superpowers. I'm special. Right. So the moment one magician clubs another magician kind of defeats that precedent. For me, I would consider it, but I don't, I'm not trying to be in his brand of superpowers, you know? What about Chris Angel? Same thing. Super, superpowers. That, that. What about any magician? Yeah, would sh- you collab with any? Like- sure. Yeah, I would, I would collab with magicians. Is, is there it, anyone that you would want to collab uh, with? Um, probably no one you guys would know. I've got I've got a few kind of social media. You know, a guy called Neil Henry, great guy. He's got you know he's got some following on on social media. I love his stuff. He's funny. He's you know good magic. Do you have any more tricks? Yeah, bro, definitely. I want to see uh, a trick. Let's try. I gotta sprinkle in these tricks. I gotta salt me with these tricks. Should we, uh, so should we try? Table. Should we try this, bro? Do me a favor. Take off your watch. Don't fucking. Oh, how much is that watch worth? I don't know, bro. <laughs> Oh boy. Ten thousand dollars. <laughs> oh if it's worth as much as that chain that chain you have, bro, we're in true. We're in trouble here. Nice. Um, okay, cool. So what I'm gonna do is um I'll okay. use my watch. No, I wanna do this, but I'll, I'll use his watch. Do me a favor. Um I'm gonna think of a time for me. All right. All should, right. should we do this? Yeah, I got a time. <laughs> yeah. Okay, cool. My favorite time of day, yeah. In fact. All right, okay, here we go. Um <laughs> favorite time of day. Yeah. You know what, dude, if you know what, dude, don't 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 tell me that. Makes it much more easy for me. Oh, shit. You know? All right. Oh, okay, this is what I'm going to do. Do me a favor. Think of a time um, that's important, but don't tell me what that is before I've done it. Hold on. Let me know when you've done it. Okay, so, I got it. You got it. Okay, yeah. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Your face right now. <laughs> okay. Hold your hand out. Hold your hand out. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's go with that. Just ignore that. Oh, okay, I'm going to keep this. I'm going to keep, keep this in front of the camera just so I don't do anything. Keep it like that. Okay. Um, Say the time. Me? Yep. 12.34. <laughs> Why? Why'd you go with that? Because there's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. What do you mean? 12.34. Is, it's one, one, two, two three, three, four. four. 12. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's very interesting. It's a good time. Yeah. Would it be impressive if, if I knew that? <laughs> yeah, bro. Spencer's watch. There's no way. Yo, shut the fuck up. This one I'll freak out on. <laughs> My eyes are watering. He's crying. I'm crying. Bro, what the fuck, bro? Whoa! Whoa! It's twelve thirty-four, bro. What oh the my. fuck? What? Yo, that what? one was weird. <laughs> that one was weird. How? I don't know, man. How? That one was weird. The, the watch is literally wound up to twelve thirty-four. Wow. I don't know about all this. You you seriously are sick. You're a sick person. <laughs> You're a sick person. Dude. You made him cry too. You like were tapping into something. You're an asshole. That was weird, bro. Because like I, when you looked at me, I felt you penetrating me. <laughs> you, were, you brain fucked our host, bro. Why would you? Why that would you do was that? weird. I'm on the verge of tears. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Good for you, man. Good for you. Good for me. Thank you. Does magic ever get like too weird for you? So it like scares people off? Uh, good question. Uh, you made that Jamaican girl cry. I did. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That, that that was out of happiness though. Yeah. She, you know, she, I think she thought it was, as she said, juju. Yeah. She thought it was like real voodoo. Juju. You know, I think honestly, I, I think it's not so much. Jamaica was the first time I felt a little bit unsafe because people were like, there were a few people that were like, you are doing witchcraft. Oh, oh you know, shit. They're going to burn, they're going to burn me, you know, but I had, I had security. I mean, obviously they're not actually going to burn me, but you know, it could get dangerous. People actually think that you're trying to go against their, you know, say their religion, religion because yeah. you're, you're doing real magic. You know, you're, you're a witch. They used to burn witches back in the day. So what yeah. if they, what if they came at you? Would you be like, this is, this is all fake. Like, don't you see the string? <laughs> that's a great question. <laughs> I don't know. That's a very, very like good Like if they question. brought torches out and like probably a, a noose. Or I, I, would probably, I would probably either say, don't worry guys, you know, it's not real. Or I would just like levitate up and, and, dip and out. float off. Or yeah. like, 
or do you let him kill you just so you can go down with that secret? <laughs> you go down with the ship like a captain. Yeah, that's probably what, that's probably what David Blaine yeah, would do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, his. I guess I'm not. I don't have as many principles as David Blaine. You know, I'm not as purist. Your your magic's like safe to connect with people, connect with women. David Blaine's is just like, dude, the dude's pulling a sword out of his butthole, and it's just like, no, because it, yo, because here's why. I think it's fucking real, bro. I think he really pulls swords out of his ass. <laughs> I'm serious. Like you can't pick up a chick. Like if you're like, hey, check this out. And you pull a card out of your scalp and it's like <laughs> bloody. And like, Yes. No, yes. That's what he does. It's incredible. It's amazing. It works. It's like, it, it, easy, Tiger. You, you okay? Take it down or not? Yeah. <laughs> How you make money, bro? How do I make money? So I, <laughs> good question. So I am um, advertising revenue on Facebook. Mm. Mm, what? Yep. Wait, you, you know this, dude. No, I don't because I don't do the Facebook anymore, but right. I was told to get no, no, into but you, it. But you, you, were, you were on ad revenue back in the day. Because I remember. Because I think I was I on the beta, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, so, so it's, it's the, the beta became a more developed version of it. Is it dope? Um, Am I missing out? I don't think you're missing out too much. Um, YouTube's better. Okay, good. Yeah, YouTube's better. I mean, look, you, you can make good money. Even if, you, even if they cut your AdSense because you're an asshole? Uh, well, you should for a friend. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, I mean, so maybe fake, I, I think you're good with uh, YouTube, you know, I think, yeah. I mean, look, maybe you're missing out a little bit, but you know, as long as you have other areas that you can. Are you making good money? Yeah, I think so. Is that what it's about? No, it's not what it's about. What is, what is it about? It's about having, why do, you, why do you do it? I do it because I love magic. I love traveling. I love meeting people. Um, yeah, it, it comes, social media and magic is part of my person. Like, like, you know, it, it, it's come from my personality. You know, it's not like I'm, I'm living off. And that's why I can never do David Blaine. I can never be that serious character because that's not who I am as a person. But, mm. I, but I don't even know if it's like the serious character. He, I mean, because it's very clear he is that way. He's like, he wants to take things to the highest possible level. But uh, I'm sure there's like a version of that you could do. I mean, but I don't know. Yeah, I mean, look, I think 2000, for me, look, the answer to your question is A, ad revenue, um, B, brand deals. So I'm actually in LA for a for a big commercial. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh, very cool. Um, so, yep, yeah, that's, you know, something else. And then um, tours. I start. I did my first live show in Mexico City last month. Um, that was a thousand people. Went absolutely great. It was a live show on stage. Great. Went better than the 25,000 person. Yeah. Yep. Yep. This is good. Um, was it just you or was it? It was just me. Yeah. 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 So, so we're gearing up for 2019, a big European tour, which will be 10 countries. Um, and that is very exciting to me as a magician to be able to connect with my audience. And that's where I think I'm very, I'm very excited to be able to, bring magic to an audience that have been watching me on the internet and it becomes, you know, stage because you have a lot of different personalities on the internet that don't actually do anything or do something. You know what I mean? Like Jake, you know, when Jake did the team's end tour, they were dancing and it was a bit random, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, so, so, so obviously a magician is going to do magic. So, so, so. Fu fuck Jake Paul is what you're saying or no? <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> Who do you like better? It's just how I interpreted it. Jake or Logan? Um, just out of curiosity. Uh, well, I did definitely Logan. Yeah, that's what it really says. <laughs> no, I do. I, I mean, I think I think your brother does actually. It clearly looks up to you because you're the one that first started it. You know. And I'm just. I'm just, I'm just, just I just, just feel Logan. like I just feel like when you ask people that question and they're yeah. here. Yeah, true. They <laughs> are, they are, they oh, ask, me say, ask me in half an hour. Yeah, because yeah. I mean, so. can you imagine if if. You said Jake, we'd have to beat your ass like the Maga kid. Yeah, dude, this, right. this, this, this scar would be nothing compared to what's on my face. Yeah, but he would just that. magically disappear. Though. Yeah, true. Have you ever um, have you ever done that? Have you ever thrown a smoke grenade? <laughs> like, yeah, you, I, you did, I did it at the airport once. It was great. You didn't like the situation. Ooh, You're like, fuck yeah. this, bang. Pff. How'd you get a smoke grenade into the airport? No, that was a joke. Uh, no, no, no. You're, you're too far down this tube now. TSA. You magically right. were tackled in the airport. Do you have another trick? We'll cut that part out. Yes. Don't worry about How it. many more tricks do you have? Uh, like one or two more. Can I see another trick? Yeah, let's do this. Um, let's. I love do, magic. I tried to get into it when I was younger. Let's, you know, you want to do a card trick? Or you want to do a? Let's do a. Let's do a little. Let's do this. I bought this. You'll like this actually. <clears> this if, you make, is, if you make me cry, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be so pissed. <laughs> All right, I'll check this out. Um, this is uh, um, Sparta. Bro, <laughs> nice. um, <laughs> I didn't know. Sorry, I didn't know where it was going. <laughs> can you still hear me? Yeah. yeah All right, we can got hold you. your hands off me. All right, check this out. You guys see this on the camera, yeah? Yeah, we got two fuzzy red this balls. Is, all right, this is going to be amazing, okay? Do me a favor, bro. Just keep your hands out like this. Hands out like this. All right, what I want you to do is, what are those? Say those. Say. Uh, I you know, it's fuzzy red balls. Fuzzy red hands. balls. Squeeze. Squeeze. Yeah, here Squeeze we go. Three, balls. two, one. Bro, did you feel that? No, I didn't feel anything, Julius. Open your hands up. Nothing happened. Open your hands up. Look, they've swapped places. Holy I don't know if they did. Shit. I don't, I'm not sure they did. I don't, I don't that, was, that was, that was, I was joking, by the way, guys. <laughs> We're pretty uh, thick. Uh, here, watch man. this. Okay, I'm gonna take this ball in this hand like this. This ball in your squeeze. Here we go. Watch this. Keep your hand closed. Three, two, one. <laughs> Boom. Have a look. 
Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> There's two balls. <laughs> the balls went in one hand. Uh, <laughs> both of the, the, okay. Pass it out. Okay, here you go. Yeah. All right. Hey, you got to come back, Mike. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I do me a favor, bro. Just, just hold on to the balls for me. Hold your hand up. You're not the first nice. person to put your balls in my hand. All right, here we go. Check this out. Okay, not the second close. either, probably. Um, this is what we're going to do, okay? <laughs> um, I want you just to think of one thing that you desire. All right? Mm. Hey, you're a successful guy. You've done very well. You've got the followers. You know, one thing that you desire that you yeah. don't have. Have you got that in your mind? Yeah. Just tell me, is what you're thinking of big or small? Oh, it's like, you're, uh, like an object? Just, just no, no, no. Something that you desire. Don't say what it is. Have you got something in your mind? Yeah, but it's like, it's no, 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 kind of no, 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 deep, I don't want to know. Like I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I just want to know. Is it big or small? It's big, bro. It's big. Okay. Let's see what you were thinking of. Open your hands. Oh. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you motherfucker. You put you, a dick in my bro, how did you know that? How did you know? How did you know dick, that? Bro? Uh, bro. How did you know I was thinking of my bro, dick, I didn't bro. do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Your dick looks like that, bro. That is the biggest mushroom tip I've ever seen. Yo, <laughs> I love you, Julius D. <laughs> I thought you were going to open your hand and it was going to be the preferred platform on YouTube again. Oh, <laughs> damn. <laughs> I was like, how is he going to present that through hand form? <laughs> You just you life really it. is a dry hand job. <laughs> can we keep this for the set? Do you need that? Yeah, bro. Yeah, You're bro. lying. Can we keep it? Do yeah. you need the fuzzy cock back? Nah, yes all or you, no? all you. Let's all you. go. That's a, that's a present. <laughs> Yo, that was amazing. <laughs> I love that trick. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> Man, I love this. This episode is great. <laughs> Do you have any more tricks? Yeah, sure. You want to see one more? Yeah, I'll see one more. All right. I like tricks. Like magic. Uh, let's do this. Should we try this with you? Bro, you've been very quiet. I've been quiet. I'm yeah. down. Okay, we're going we're gonna to do this. Often quiet on the impulse. Episode. He's not quiet. He's reflective. He's reflective. Dude. I like that. Yeah, yeah, I can see that. Um, so, once my, my, my audio is coming in and out. It's kind of a bit weird. All right, so what I want to do. I want to take this out. Okay, so what I want to do is... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, bro. I, I, I honestly think... I don't think it's that. I think it's more just... Oh, no, it's all good. Yeah, it's cool. a string, I think. All right, what I want to do is... <laughs> It's a string. Yeah, you gotta move around the string. Yeah, you're right. Um, I want you, bro, just to think of a card for me. All right? Yeah, oh, no, don't say what it is. You're absolutely right. <laughs> Professional over here. Okay. <laughs> I'm just a mere magician. Don't say what it is. Yeah. Have you got that card in your mind? Yeah. Three, two, one, change your mind. Yeah, have you got a new card? Yeah. All right, yeah okay, yeah. we go. I'm gonna keep on get one more time. Okay. Three, two, one, change your mind again. You got the new card? Say that card. The Jack of Diamonds. Jack of Diamonds. Pack of cards here, look. Okay, I see look, that. I'm gonna go through like yeah. this. Jack of diamonds, what's he gonna do? I'm gonna go through all the cards. Okay. Face oh, up. He's gonna go through all of them. All the cards are face up. Why is my heart beating? One card turned over. Do you see that? I see it. Bro, take it off me. This is gonna be a fail. Ah, uh, it's the fucking Jack of Diamonds. You son of a bitch. The exact card we lost on Blackjack last night at the casino, by the way. So thanks a lot for fucking bringing that back. I lost $3,000, so thanks. Thanks, thanks man. Yeah, yeah, three Gs, man. Lost. They, on. they dragged you to the casino? Yeah, they, no, got, they whoa, got me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He was on board for this one. Well, because I was playing Fortnite all day. Got to do something. He had, just just he had, a side note. You know, anytime you go to the casino, if you want to win money, I have to be there. Do you remember why? No. Remember, remember how much bank you and I won? Oh, in Vegas. Uh, yeah. yeah. Evan's birthday. Of course, that was incredible. Yeah. Hey, hey Evan's birthday. birthday. Yo, but guys, hold on. So just figure out Evan's birthday. Watch this. I'm gonna take the ace like this. Okay, yeah. Here we go. If I just go like that, hold on. Okay, you're ripping it. He's if ri if ripping Evan it. appears He's right now, I'm gonna lose my shit, dude. <laughs> hold on. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. He's, okay. Well, he's in front of the camera, and <sighs> no, gone. Okay. All right. Hold on. Disappearing cards. No okay. Problem. Hold on. Um, let's try this. Uh, do me a favor, bro. Stand up. Stand up. What happened? No, yeah, just reach up there. Reach up there. Up, 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 up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Come right. on, dude. No, no, no. Shut that Come off. on, dude. Sh show the camera. That's it. Were you in this house? Be what the frick? Were you in this house? Did you break into our house? No, that <laughs> fits, bro. Yo, what the fuck, dude? What? Yo, I... <laughs> Thanks for coming to Impulsive Rob. I need you to leave my house. Yeah. <laughs> just, just get what is your problem, hey, bro? I appreciate you, man. <laughs> God damn. Yo, burnt wall. Julius Dean, bro, seriously, thank you for coming on Impulsive. You're, you've um, thoroughly freaked me out. I'm, that was, you are incredible. You're a great magician and uh, a, great, a great person, I can tell. So uh, thank you for coming on. Where can they find you on social? Uh, Instagram at Julius Dean. 
Big facts. Guys, thank you for watching this episode of Impossible. We're going to do an audio Q&A only with Julius right now. So uh, if you're not subscribed, you know what to, what to do. Subscribe wherever you listen to podcasts, iTunes, YouTube, Spotify, etc. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, before I sign off, Evan's birthday is February 11th. We're going to Vegas. Yeah. I'm going to drop 50K and put it on black. I will do the same. Big moves. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> we love you guys. Take it easy, fam. Peace. <laughs> <laughs>